Hey, what's up? This counter surveillance coming at you with another video. This video is out of Philadelphia and the Wilmington, Delaware area. This guy right here is Keith Gibson. He's a serial killer and robber who committed several murders and robberies over several months in 2021. I'm going to give a timeline of his homicides and robberies since he was released from Delaware State Prison in December 2020. Gibson's first homicide, his first known homicide, was on January 28th, 2021. Let's go ahead and take a look. Well, it's just an eerily quiet scene here. Just hours before those two men, as Jim just mentioned, were shot and killed. And I'll step out of the way so that you can take a look at what we're talking about. You have a number of three police officers right here in front of the Al Medina Trader store. This is where those two men were shot. They were inside the store when it happened. Now, we know that it happened in broad daylight. Police say that someone walking by the store found the two men inside the store around 1 p.m. Now, both of them had been shot at the time, but by the time that medics got here, it was way too late to save them. So this psychopath just finished a 13-year stretch in Delaware State Prison on manslaughter, and several weeks later, he commits a homicide of murdering two people in their store. Unfortunately, his homicidal ways was not finished. On February 8, 2021, he murdered his own mother at her place of business and left her for dead for one of her co-workers to find her. He was taken into custody for suspicion of her murder, but they couldn't prove that he did it. But his contact with police violated his parole and he was subsequently detained by his parole officer. Gibson was held in jail for several weeks for violating his parole and he was eventually released on April 27, 2021. On May 15th, approximately two weeks after he was released, he robbed and murdered a female Metro PCS employee in Delaware. He robbed and murdered a young woman. Her vehicle was eventually found in Philadelphia. This guy is a fucking psychopath. People, you have to be aware that it's people out here on these streets just like this. He's not the only one. And unfortunately, this maniac is not finished. On June 5, 2021, at approximately 5.30 a.m., he robbed and murdered a female Dunkin' Donuts manager. I watched the original raw video, and it's absolutely heartbreaking. This woman complied with everything he asked for, and he murdered her in cold blood. Psychopaths lack remorse because they lack empathy. So murdering her, he didn't think twice about it. Men, if your mother, sister, girlfriend, wife... If they work early shifts and they have to be to work to open up, walk with her. Make sure she gets in safely. Check the scene. Don't forget your firearm. You're the protection. Think strategically and move tactically. Always have your mind on situational awareness. And to the women, I recommend you get a firearm, get training, and protect yourself. All right, on June 6th, just a day after the homicide in North Philly at the Dunkin' Donuts, he drove back to Delaware, robbed, shot, and killed a man on the streets of Wilmington. This marked his sixth known homicide in five months. Just two days later, on June 8th, 2021, in Wilmington, Delaware, he robbed a Rite Aid. Good thing an employee slipped a GPS tracker in the bag and he was able to be tracked down by police. He was subsequently arrested and booked into the local jail. My sincerest condolences to the families of the victims. I pray that you have peace through these difficult times. All right, this is Counter Surveillance. I hope you enjoyed the video, but more importantly, I hope you learned something. And remember, beware and be aware. Shalom.